So, if you talk about the wave mechanical concept of atoms, according to De Broglie hypothesis, an electron of mass m in motion with a velocity v is associated with a wave whose wavelength is lambda, which is given by lambda is equal to h by mv, where h is the Planck's constant. So, on the basis of a De Broglie hypothesis, an atom model was proposed in which the stationary ob orbits of Bose model were retained, but with the difference that electron in various orbits behave as a wave. You can see the waves. This is referred to as a De Broglie hypothesis. You can see here, based on the value of n, automatically the different shape of the outer orbit is done. 7, 8, 9, 10, 3, 4. So, you are able to see the orbits here. So, let's talk about the wave mechanical concept of atom. It was suggested that the stationary objects are those in which orbital circumference 2 pi r is an integral multiple of de Broglie wavelength lambda. Therefore, the stationary orbits for an electron are those which contain the complete wave of electron and we got the equation as 2 pi r is equal to n lambda. Over here, n is nothing but 1, 2, 3, it's the orbit and r is the radius of the orbit. Replacing your 2 pi r is lambda with the h by mv, you will be getting 2 pi r is equal to n into h by mv. Or is mv into r is equal to n h divided by 2 pi. This is the equation we got. It is seen that the total angular momentum of the moving electron is an integral multiple of h divided by 2 pi. That's de Broglie concept confirms the Bose postulate.